Hi, I'm Kunal Chaudhary, founder of DSIM, and welcome to this video brought to you by Learn with DSIM. In today's video, we are going to talk about a very good feature which we have, which all marketers are having, you and me included, in Google AdWords. The name of the feature is Auction Insights. Have you heard of it? Yes, no? Well, I didn't know about you, but I can assure you one thing that not many marketers are aware of this feature. It's a very good feature. It's a must use feature. It's a feature that helps us compare our advertisements to our competitors. Yes, Auction Insights, what we can do is using this feature, we can compare the performance of our advertising campaigns in Google AdWords with our competitors, people who have been advertising on the same set of keywords which we are advertising in Google AdWords. So on different parameters, we can compare our advertisements to those who are also advertising alongside in the same auction on the same set of keywords, our competitors. Isn't it good? So the reason why I have picked today's uh, this particular uh, topic, Auction Insights, this feature to discuss in this video tutorial is because recently I met a couple of freelancers, digital marketing freelancers who have been doing digital marketing from last, I think, two plus years. And we started talking about uh, AdWords and optimizing campaigns and the new features which AdWords is coming up, especially the new interface. Surprisingly, they were not aware of this feature auction inside. And they have been into digital marketing from last two plus years. I met them at an event. So what I thought, if these two people are not aware of this feature, then there would be a lot of marketeers, not all, but still good number of marketeers who would not be available, who would not be aware of this feature. So in today's tutorial, what I'm going to discuss is why this feature is so important on what all parameters we can compare the performance of our campaigns and our advertisements in comparison to our uh, competitors and how this feature is going to help us to optimize and improve our campaign performances. So let's see how this campaign can help us. So guys, uh, I'm in this campaign. Uh, it's a very old account. So these are the these are the campaigns which have been run in this particular AdWords account. And when you talk about auction insights, so comparing your campaigns along with your competitors, we can do it on different uh, at different levels. So we can compare campaigns to campaigns. We can compare ad groups to ad groups, and we can compare performance our advertising perform ad our ads performance on particular set of keywords or a single keyword to those of our competitors, okay? So what I'll do is for this particular tutorial, I am gonna explain uh, comparing a particular keyword of mine on which uh, we were advertising and against the people who were also bidding on the same keyword. So this is uh, the particular campaign and there were three ad groups in it, so I'll go to uh, the third ad group out here because only this ad group has few clicks. All right, so there you go, guys. Uh, in this ad group, the keywords which we targeted are uh, plots in Nimrana, Nimrana property, projects in Nimrana, and blah, 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 okay? So the reason why I will select the first keyword plots in Nimrana is because Quite simple because it, it has got most number of clicks in comparison to others. So what, I, what you have to do is guys, now the objective is to check the performance of our campaign, our advertisements on this particular keyword, plots in Nimbrana, against the people who are present in the same auction in Google search on the same keyword. So what I'll do is I'll select this keyword and the moment I select, uh, you see this, so this has popped up auction insight. So I'll just repeat this 
feature. So all you have to do is select your particular keyword for which you would like to do competitors analysis and you have to click on auction insights. There you go, once you click on it, now these are on the left hand side guys, these are the people, these are the competitors who have been advertising alongside uh, with me, they have been bidding on the same keyword. So first is Asiana Housing, then uh, if IIFL Reality, Novel Group 99 Acres, Common Floor, Magic Braids, etc, etc, Quicker, and you see this th uh, the second number, U. So I'm featuring on the second number, which is a very good thing. Now what I, I can do is I can compare how my campaign performed in com in my against my competitors these competitors on different parameters okay so the, there are six parameters on the basis of which google allows you to uh, do a sort of a comparison so that you can improve your strategy you can change your strategy by checking your performance so first search parameter is impression share now what this means is that out of the total eligible impressions which I was supposed to get, okay, how many did I get? So I got 88.7% of the total impressions, which means if uh, my keyword plots in Nimrana was searched 400 times, then my ad appeared 88.7%. And if I check the impression share of the rest of the competitors, then I am doing far, far better, okay? <clears throat> then the second uh, parameter is average position. Now what average position is that on this particular keyword, if I'm running two different uh, advertisements or one advertisements, then what is the average position? So you must be knowing that uh, when you uh, go for a real time auction and you bid on uh, Google AdWords, so your, ad your advertisements, you know, it's, there is no particular fixed ad slot that will be allocated or will be assigned by Google AdWords to your ad. Depending on a lot of parameters, your ad position will fluctuate. What are the parameters? I will talk about them later probably in some in other video tutorial. So as of now, I'll stick to this. So average ad, ad position. So the person, the competitor who has been beating me in terms of average ad position is ashianahousing.com. So this ad, this guy, my competitor, whenever he is, his ad is appearing, he is, is getting number one position. My ad position is 1.7 and the rest of the competitors, they are below me. Okay, so in terms of average position, I am number two. However, impression share, I am getting maximum number of impressions. And this guy, Ashiana Housing, he is getting less than 10% of the impressions. Okay, so if my ad appeared 100%, this guy, uh, this guy, uh, the, my competitor advertisement appeared less than 10%. So what this guy is probably doing is his budget is less and he, want, he wants to make sure is that whenever his ad appears, it is on number one. So probably he has bid accordingly. And my objective is to get maximum number of impressions or my objective was, since this is a very old account, that to get a maximum number of impressions and also retain the top two positions. So this is, uh, this is the second parameter. Now we'll go to the third parameter, which is overlap rate. Now what is overlap rate? Overlap rate is that if my advertisement appeared 100 times, then how many times the rest of the competitors, they were in the same auction, their advertisements appeared in the same auction at the same time. So the biggest competitor of mine is IAFL Reality in terms of overlap rate, because if my advertisement appeared 100 times, then his advertisement alongside my ad appeared 46.33% times, okay? And the second is 99 acres. So if my advertisement appeared 10 times, my ad got uh, 10 impressions, their advertisements got 4.4 impression. That's how it works. The next parameter would be uh, position above rate. Now this is again very good. What it means is that how many times 
uh, these competitors of mine they have got a position above me okay so that's that's what the position above rate is so Ashiana House saying this guy whenever his ad is appearing alongside my advertisement his ad is coming above my advertisement 100% of the times and in comparison to IFL reality their advertisement is topping my ad 59% so this is what it means and then top of the page rate now guys you know that in search engine result page and Google the maximum clicks are uh, given or the people you know the search people who search in Google most of the times they end up in clicking the top three or four advertisements right so this is what the next parameter is so top of the page rate what it means is that how many times my advertisement appeared on top of the page on the first three or four ad slots in comparison to the competitors so this is how it is so my advertisement out of the it out of the n number of shares which are uh, n number of impressions I beg for your pardon, the n number of impressions which my advertisement received, my advertisement was visible in the top of the page, which is good enough. And then outranking share. So what outranking share is, that how many times my advertisement had beaten the competitors. So this is uh, how many times my advertisement appeared above them. So guys, this is what auction insight is and it is a very very good feature very good uh, feature when you talk about optimizing your campaigns okay this is a must use feature why because it helps you strategize accordingly for example you might be getting uh, 100 clicks and several leads or few sales out of 100 clicks and you're very happy but your competitor might be getting 300 okay so what it will help you understand is that there is more possibility and your competitors are getting much more out of it than what you are getting so that you can strategize accordingly either you can increase your daily budget or you can you know optimize your campaign on different parameters like you can uh, try to in increase your uh, CTR you can try to increase the quality score you can try to increase the engagement level of your landing page the relevancy of a landing page so you can improve your campaigns for uh, the performance and so that ad rank which is the name of the algorithm that ranks uh, the advertisements on google search you know so your advertisement your campaign is well suited as per the algorithm or different set of algorithms of ad rank so guys this is the feature as of now this feature is available for two different types of campaigns in Google AdWords number one is search campaigns and number two is shopping campaigns so for search campaigns we have six different parameters to compare with and in shopping campaigns we have got just uh, three I believe yeah three so there you go guys uh, this do try this feature if you haven't tried it already and uh, let us know in the comments uh, how did you find this feature and if you enjoyed watching this video make sure you like it and to get more such video tutorials do not forget to subscribe to our channel and if you want you can also share it i would really appreciate that so thank you so much for watching this video enjoy optimizing your campaigns in google adwords thank you